We talk about things past midline in developmental medicine. What are we, what are we talking about when we use this word midline and transferring things like that? A babies have a, one of the reflexes that babies have it, uh, immediately at birth is what called the tonic neck reflexes, where they, they, if you turn the neck or the head towards a certain direction, the baby's arm and leg in that direction get stretched out, and the opposite arm and leg are flexed. It's almost like assuming a fencing position. When you turn your, the baby's neck to the other side. Uh, he reverses this position and that is a reflex that will interfere with the baby to centralize or to reach things in the midline position because it forces uneven direction of arms and legs. After four months that reflex starts to disappear. So from that point on the baby has the capacity of bringing his arms into the midline and starting to be able to either reach for things in the midline, for instance, reach for maternal face. A, later on, like around six months, they start to, a, if you put a cube in his hand or some object, he may be able to bring the two a, a, to the midline and a, a bang them together and so on. So that is a, extremely important also for the baby to be able to start turning and uh, reaching towards a particular direction, uh, for instance, if uh, he reach, uh, tries to reach certain sounds or certain objects or uh, certain uh, colors that he may be stimulated by, uh, and obviously that lateralization needs to be minimized in order to be able to reach the midline.